Hi everyone, welcome to the fifth episode of my Spiritual Biography series. This time we're looking at Virat Tora, my Germadar Vanguard, who was originally created for the Gamma Recruit event. And of course, um, he's Germadar Vanguard and it's... It was, it was all the craze back, back then during the Victoria's Life um, expansion, so... <laughs> Alright, let's jump right in. Alright, so before we jump into his bio, how about we look at his costumes? or armors. <laughs> so uh, first up is the con concerted armor from the Gamo reputation. And we can also put his helmet on. On the side there's the... I put a marine disguise on him that I got from the Christmas event, winter event. There's the German Air Tactical which came out free a few months ago I think, or was it last year? It's been some time. <laughs> And finally, the Lifetime Suspicion uniform exclusive to Jamadar. Now, um, this uniform did not actually come with trousers, so for trousers I, um, I used the Jamadar Tactical ones, which have the piping on the side, similar to what is shown here. And overall they look pretty similar. So, I thought, eh, you can use them interchangeably. Alright, so uh, we're on the Jamadar Bridge. It's a pretty small bridge. But um, as we do this, you can see Jamadar walking around, as well as some of my bridge officers. And of course, I forgot to mention that um, the Jamadar Vanguard have some very stylish hair, huh? And head crests. Okay, let's jump into the bio. So it's a bit cheesy, a bit um, generic, and uh, maybe cliche. <laughs> a proud and powerful Jamadar vanguard, Virat Tora is one of the first vanguards bred in the Gamma Quadrant. And I can say that because he was indeed made on day one of Victory's life. Born with, the, born with exceptional tactical expertise in space combat, Virat Tora commands his ship strategically into battle. He is also an ace in ground combat, excellent in covert operations and direct engagements. His body is tall, lean, fat, and agile. Oh, so part of this um, biography is based on the innate trait to Jemadar Vanguards, which is bonus weapon damage, critical chance, and critical severity in both space and ground. So, uh, maybe this view means that um, Jemadar Vanguard are very good for combat in terms of DPS. Well, overall, Romulans still surpass them way over with their huge amounts of critical severity and um, critical chance. Even with your full set of um, Jemadar Vanguard, it doesn't beat military training for the Romulans, so... Yep, <laughs> Romulan military training surpasses genetic en engineering. Who knew? <laughs> well, in the game, anyway. <laughs> so, yeah, um, in terms of... Um, the crew, it's uh, almost full um, Jemadar crew with the three Jemadar vanguards. Okay, I don't remember, I don't quite remember which ones they were. This guy, this guy, and uh, this guy. No. <laughs> yeah, this guy. Okay, well. And I also have two Conrex uh, hologram because he has superior shroud compared to other. Um, Jebedar, which only have regular crowd. Whoops, not that guy. So yeah, he's my full-on Jemadar character. I decked him out with Jemadar stuff. And a nice Jemadar Vanguard ship, so... Yeah, he's basically my Jemadar Vanguard role-playing character and everything like that. And of course, no chairs on the bridge. Paired with some Federation officers back there because he's allied with the Federation. Do I wish that the Dominion had their own um, faction? Oh yeah, definitely, but you know, limitations, limitations. Alright, well that's pretty much it for this video. Thanks for watching. Hope you found it enjoyable and interesting. Please subscribe and ring the notification bell to be notified of future videos and to support this channel. See you guys next time. Bye!